Can you think of a fabric from your childhood that stands out for you? Maybe it's the blanket you used to curl up with or a special tablecloth your grandmother would lay out for the holidays. Designer Candace Kay is here to show us how to get creative with your table setting this summer by mixing old with new. And Candace, I love this idea because I love anything that's nostalgic or makes you feel happy. So tell me more about that. But first, tell me where you are right now. Oh, I'm in Pompano Beach, Florida. I came to Miami for a project and I'm in my grandmother's condo. I've been coming here since I was a kid. Um, my dad's parents actually also lived in Fort Lauderdale just down the street, which is crazy. <laughs> and nothing has changed in this condo. <laughs> same furniture, same linen, same smell. But I think that's what makes this place so special. There is something so special about that. When I go to my childhood home, which my parents are still living in, I love the fact that it has that smell because it's always going to remind me of good things. Mm -hmm. So the place you were in must be full of memories and, and goodies from the past then. Tell us about what you found there because it's all about mixing old with new, right? Oh, totally. Tracy, <laughs> everything from my childhood is here. But one of the things that I noticed um, when it comes to fabric and textiles is those are these doilies. And I feel like every, everyone's grandmother has had one of these, but she has had this on her dinner table since I can remember. <laughs> and I just love that when you look at fabric, I feel like there's memories attached to it. There's a feeling it takes you back to a place or a time or a person. Whenever I see this, I think of her. So I thought for sure I had to use it. So I called her and Baba, which is Macedonian for grandmother. And I was like, Baba, I'm going to use your doilies for like a dinner party. Do you mind? And she was like, you're crazy. Don't do that. <laughs> you're going to dirty it. But she can't tell me what to do out here. She's so far away. So she knew that I was going to do it anyway. So you are going to do it anyway. She is going to mess around with your Baba's <laughs> linens. Listen, it's a, it's a beautiful idea, though, because you're incorporating some of her into your space or into the space you're in right now, which is her space. So did you incorporate it into uh, the summer table setting? So I didn't for this one, but I did something even better. And I didn't tell her this one because I, she probably would tell me no. But I went into her linen closet and I found her old bed sheet. <laughs> and I was like, oh, what a cool idea to use it as a tablecloth. Such a simple idea, but think about the nostalgia. That's beautiful. <laughs> I'm thinking of bed sheets past that I would actually use for a tablecloth. Do I have any of those? Anyways, I love the idea. How <laughs> did you finish the look, Candice? I feel like it mixes the vintage with the nostalgia, with that like warm and cozy, shabby chic that you get from your past. And I mixed it with our new embroidered linen. And I feel like the combination of the two is about mixing the old with the new, bringing in a pop of color. This is hand embroidery. They're so beautiful. And then I layered a bunch of linen on top. And use the linen as, tape, as, as placemats as well, which I love doing. That's beautiful. You know, it also adds some glamor to the table, even if you don't have fancy dinnerware, doesn't it? Yeah, I feel like you don't really need a lot I always say that, you know, when you're ready, like you're feeling a little low and you want to get dressed up and you want to look pretty and you just feel better when you do that. Ultimately, that's what you should be doing with your table. It's such an easy facelift. And this is such a cute little idea for a breakfast or a brunch. It doesn't have to be a fancy dinner. It could be something that just as casual as a breakfast with your coffee in the morning. Yeah, if I think if we've learned anything during this pandemic, it's use your good stuff. Make it pretty for you. It doesn't have to be a special occasion. Now, what I want you to do, Candice, is send this link to your Baba. I want to know what she thinks. Is she going <laughs> to kill you for taking the sheets off her bed that she's actually using and putting it on the table? I want you to record that response and send it to me. Thank you, Candice. I think uh, we've got some good inspiration here. Thank you. So, everyone at home, dig into those linen closets, pull out the old bed sheets and the doilies, have some fun.